with an adjustable solar panel, three cameras, and four sturdy tires, the part-time scientist rover looks ready for action. The team has been at work on the rover since 2008, says founder Robert Burma, using components originally designed for earthbound electronics and for satellites. Using technology which is kind of not intended to send something to the moon is always very risky. So um, we have to really slim down everything so that it fits into this less than four tons uh, payload vehicle. Cost is a concern as well, which is one reason the team is making its rover as high tech as possible. So what we want to try to do is make as much as high tech as you would call it a wable for space applications so that you have like more processing power for less energy, which you cut energy is your number one constraint in space. So, and that really cuts down into our mission costs. Burma expects their mission cost will be under $30 million. He hopes to secure a contract for a launch vehicle by the end of the year and send the rover on its way by the end of 2017. The 15 other teams in the competition are from Brazil, Canada, Chile, Hungary, Japan, Israel, Italy, Malaysia, India, and the United States. I'm Faith Lapidus, VOA News.